Hi. Well, after working at Cartoon Network for about uh, 14 years, uh, an opportunity came that I couldn't turn down. And uh, I partnered up with the uh, Orphanage visual effects company from San Francisco, and we opened up Orphanage Animation Studios, where we would produce and develop um, animated features and as well as television. So this is the first time anybody's gotten to see our little house studio. So come on in, and I'll show you around. All right, here we are. And so uh, what we decided to do first was we uh, we didn't want to go into an office building because all of us kind of worked together in office buildings before. So we found this great little house that we could just kind of uh, move into and uh, kind of put up artwork and start doing development and stuff. So this is the studio where we work. And there's only four of us in the beginning. And this is kind of our main story area. And uh, we have a lot of our story meetings here trying to figure out what we're going to do. This is one of our projects we're developing. I'm not going to get too far into it, but it's basically themed around Vikings. And it's got a lot of great action and cool sets and stuff like that. Um, so you can follow me in here. And then we have the dining area, also used for meetings and stuff. And once we kind of got ramped up into production, this will be all probably filled with cubicles and stuff. And there's some uh, random artwork uh, hanging up from uh, different feature films and also from uh, some of the TV projects that we have also. So let's continue in here. Here's some more development for uh, Vikings. So we have kind of like this hag character, and also we have uh, some great kind of Russian Viking-themed type costumes that we've been kind of experimenting with. Uh, but it's all in state of development. So here's another uh, great hallway of or Orphanage Animation Studios. And here we have uh, another one of our feature film ideas that we've been developing. And here's some uh, great art on it. Uh, and this is a family story about kind of uh, a kid and his parents and how uh, they kind of get along and stuff. I'm not going to give away a lot of details, but let's go up and see some of the guys. So come on in. And here we have kind of where all the guys sit. Here we have uh, Craig Kelman, but he's not here today. And uh, over here we have uh, Brian Andrews. Brian's working, you know him from Samurai Jack. Brian does boards and writing. And here's Paul Rudish, also from Samurai Jack Star Wars. And uh, Paul also does uh, drawing, designing, writing, a little bit of everything. And so it's kind of great to be in this house because it's so much more comfortable and uh, you know, we're not next to a dentist office or whatever. It's, it's kind of like, um, you know, like home. And so uh, we've actually been also been working on this, uh, these monitors more so there's less paper. Uh, but anyways, let's go and uh, see my office. So here we are. And I have my, uh, my computer set up. I also have my animation desk because I still uh, love to animate. And whenever I get a chance to, I uh, try to do it. And then, of course, I have my Roots, which is uh, Dexter's Lab, and I have my Samurai Jack. One of my favorite things is this picture over here from the Macy's Day Parade where we had a, a Dexter balloon float. And behind him was the poster for Ego Trip, the Dexter movie at the time coming out. So it was kind of cool. And I was there, and it was kind of this great rainy day. And um, it was a great experience kind of uh, to have a, something you've created in the Macy's Day Parade. But anyways, thank you for visiting Orphanage Animation Studios. I hope uh, soon you'll be able to come watch one of our movies. And uh, thank you for buying the Samurai Jack Season 4 DVD. So long.